Welcome viewers, to my new video on, Homemade Pulse Motor. A pulsed motor, uses short pulses of current to drive the motor, making it spin. The part of the motor that spins is called the rotor. It acts as a flywheel. Here I have used ferrite, core coil, with about 400 windings, a plastic rotor, neodymium magnets, a homemade reed switch. Checking power supply. Here is a simple circuit diagram connection, where north or south pole may be front facing. Rotor has multiple permanent magnets spaced equally around its periphery. Making connection as per given circuit, you can see a little trembling, giving little spin, it's rotating faster clockwise. Reed switch is made from two thin blades, cut out from shaving eraser separated from one another. You can also buy a simple red switch for this purpose. Ferrite core coil works efficiently. Electrical coils are normally wounds so that, when energized with a short pulse of current, they produce a repulsive force. This repulses the magnet in the rotor, causing it to rotate. After being energized by a short pulse, the magnetic field formed around the electrical coil then collapses. As it collapses a current is produced in the coil, sometimes called back EMF electromotive force. This current is small and can be harnessed, stored or utilized. Changing reed switch position left or right, may increase or decrease rotor speed. Rotor speed seems to be increasing. You can also see sparks in reed switch. Connecting a small neon bulb, of nearly 30 volts. Light from neon bulb is bright enough. Removing connecting wires. Now interchanging coil connection with reed switch. We observe that rotor is moving in anti-clockwise direction. Neon bulb still glowing bright. Observing the multimeter reading. Again interchanging connections. Again we can see, it is gaining speed quickly. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Be sure to share my channel with others, check out my video playlists, and rate thumbs up.